Hello, we are doing community of sum today and community of sum is when you write down the first item, next, for instance, first is one, next you type something like previous plus next, next is two, and we will make community of sum of first two numbers, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten. And cumulative of all of them is, let's see, 55. Okay, uh, but uh, cumulative sum is very common task for businesses. It lets us do ABC analysis and other funny stuff also with Google Sheets and with spreadsheets in general. Uh, so let's learn how to do it uh, with array formula and new lambda will let us do it really fast and easy. And all you need to know is scan. Scan is your key. Uh, scan will uh, will scan initial value. Initial value is zero. And we'll scan this array. In our case it's array of from one to ten. And next after comma lambda goes into thin and let's call this lambda and it has two parameters inside this scan. It's spatial parameters because we use scan. It is initial value, I'll call it ini. And uh, sorry, I misspell it. Uh, and also current value, I'll call it just v. So we have this ini and v and what we want to do to make some just ini plus v and then we close parens and hit enter and you see this is now array formula so if I do it for the wall range it will work for the wall range it will produce cumulative sum up to the end of this sheet up to the line 1000 in my case, but in your case it may be a different line. Let's see what is the cumulative sum of sequence 100. Let us see. 50 50. Okay, so that's the answer, and you have the answer for each line now because you have uh, this uh, beautiful uh, scan. And the rest you need to do is to pack it into named function. Let's do it together, it's uh, really easy. We'll just need to copy this definition Ctrl A, Ctrl C, and next go to the menu uh, data named functions. It's my uh, favorite menu item now named no not named ranges but named functions try it again and now I hit it right next click add new function and it will be something like community sum yes you will type it correctly I control V my definition here and all I need is data this is data you see, it suggests me cell, range, orgs, but I prefer data. Next, define. Uh, it called my function uh, one, but I don't want. I want cumulative sum. Or cum, just for this sample. Because we don't have other function called cum. You can add custom description. Next you can add description for all your parameters in my uh, case this is one parameter called data and example I always do it for uh, my name functions for my collection but in this case we just want to try it uh, for uh, educational purpose so I just click create without uh, oh by the way I misspelled it instead of uh, sum I printed come okay uh, but it's cumulative sum, so come is also okay. Okay, this is our come, and data will be the same. And just as magic, we see that now it's just come three uh, letters, or maybe mm, some more meaningful name. But instead of all this, instead of remembering this scan lambda and so forth, just need to know where your named function is in which file you have this and you also can create an 
collection of named functions uh, like I have. Let, let me show you in the moment. So here it is, my site loading on articles uh, slash formulas and this is my collection of named functions and it now has more than 50 named functions. It's great. If I post just one function per week, I'll make it like a year of content. And you can click on this new only and see my new created uh, named functions and uh, have fun with them. All of them has a specific spreadsheet with um, examples so you can uh, click here and play with all of them. And also some of them has videos like this one, cumulative sum, now it has video but not, not all of them. So these videos are blank. So this is what is waiting for you on my YouTube channel. Thanks.